Hi, welcome to Algo Tech Programming Concept. In this video lecture, uh, we uh, we will solve the recurrence equation Tn is equal to Tn minus A plus Ta plus Cn. So we can uh, we have to solve this recurrence equation using recursion tree method. So there are few steps that we can solve this equation. Uh, so the first step is that we have to find the root node value of this Tn. So we can see that the root node value of Tn is C of n. Then uh, and then we have to find that this root node value is further divided in how many parts. Means this root node is contains how many number of sub problems. So we can see that this root node contains uh, two sub problem Tn minus A and T of A. Okay, so left sub problem is t of n minus a and right sub problem is t of a. Okay, so and, and and we have to repeat step num step number one until we get the individual element. Then in third step we have to find the depth of tree. Then we will compute the cost at each level in step number four. And in step number five we will compute the time complexity t of n. So this is our original equation. Uh, we have written equation number one. Okay, so first we have to find the root node value of this T of n. So T of the root node of T of n is C n. Now uh, we we uh, can see that C n is divided in two parts. The left sub problem will be T of n minus a, and the right sub problem is our T of a. So again we have to find the root node value of Tn minus a and T of a. So we can find the root node value of Tn minus a um, from equation number 1 by substitution method. Okay, so this is our T of n. The root node is Cn. Cn is again to, uh, has two sub problem Tn minus a and T of a. So we have to get this T of n minus a root node value. Okay, so we will substitute n minus a in place of n from equation number 1 okay so in from uh, in place of n we will put n minus a n minus a plus t of a because in t of a there is no n so leave it plus c in place of n we have to put n minus a so the t of n minus a will become t of n minus 2a plus t of a plus c n minus a and uh, like that we have to find the root node value of t of a so in place of n we have to put a so in place of n we have to put a here so uh, t of a is equal to t of a plus c a this is equation number three so every time when we find the root node value we will use equation number one original equation we will use so uh, the Tn minus A, the root node of Tn minus A is Cn minus A and the root node value of T of A is C of A and C of A is uh, only have one sub part. Here we can see from equation number 3 that this C of A root node C A uh, is only have, ha, ha, uh, is only having one sub problem and C of N minus A is again divided in two parts t n minus 2a and t of a now we have to find the root node value of t n minus 2a so we will place um, n minus 2a in place of n and we will derive equation number one so t of n minus 2a will become t of n minus 3a plus t of a plus c n minus 2a and again we have to find that the root node value of t of a so this is our root node value of t of a so again we will divide this uh, again we will find the root node value of t n minus 2a so the root node value of t n minus 2a is c n minus 2a means c n minus 2 c a again so t n minus 2a the root node value of uh, t n minus 2a c n minus 2a and again like that we will further divide the tree and the question is that uh, uh, question is that that in how many uh, how many iterations we will use to divide the root node value so the answer is that that uh, when uh, we will assume that this tree is divided 
until the individual element when we will find the individual element then we will stop the divide process so root node will be divided until we get, get the individual element okay so like that we will find the root node n minus 3a n minus 4a n minus i a what is i i is known as depth okay so now we have to find the depth so this is our recursion tree here okay so we can find the depth by comparing with the individual element so n minus i a is equal to 1 so here i is our depth so this is our depth here now next step is that we have to compute cost at each level so the so at level 1 the cost is cn means you can say level 0 and or level 1 whatever you can say so in level 1 the cost is c of n in level 2 if you perform some in this level 2 cn minus ca plus ca so the rest is c of n so like that at each level we are getting the uh, cost c of n c is constant factor okay c the value of c should be greater than 0 so you can take the value of c as n and at the first level second level third level fourth level if you compute the cost at fourth level cn minus 3 ca and these are the positive 3 ca terms so it will be cancelled and we will have c of n so this is the cost at each level then again we have to find the time complexity so so we can find the time complexity as a summation of these cost of each level and the we have to sum up to the uh, depth i okay so we find the c into n into i so and i is n minus a divided by a so uh, the the term will be n square minus n square divided by a minus n divided by a so we will ignore the least terms so highest term is n square and we can represent this n square in any form in big os form or in theta form so it's a representation uh, of the asymptotic notations so you can use any uh, notations so in uh, many books you can find the notation big oh in many books the same uh, complexity is denoted by theta in uh, and uh, also by omega so it's a representation style that you have to uh, choose big oh or theta so this is the solution n square thanks for watching